Sing. All right, well, that was a good one for no prep this time. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Scott Filmref may be here, back again with some world entrance syndrome with my friends, Achiever and Sato. Hey. Hello. Uh, it's been a while since we've recorded. Uh, it's been about two, three weeks. Uh, pretty busy month, uh, but we're back at it again uh, with some more Mimey Root. Uh, I really can't remember much about what's happened since... Uh, besides, uh, Sato had reminded me that we saw Mimi go into the hotel with someone who he got mistaken for trying to stalk, uh, Rainy Kai, though. That's kind of it that I remember. I don't really much remember my... All I know is that it's, she's being a little I, sus. I don't remember really anything. I've got a really bad memory. I know she's being a little sus and going around and seeing that one dude, Sagamiya, whatever his name is. <clears throat> Shit like that. Um, but let's jump right into it, as Philip DeFranco would say. We're going to be going to school today. Uh, that's school right there. Oh, hi -oh. oh, God, it's really loud. I don't want my mic to pay that. Jesus. Um, oh, I can't skip this dialogue, so we haven't seen this? Okay. Um, <clears throat> you, you came to school, too? You must have nothing to do, huh? Huh? Me? Hmm. I just wanted to use the club room for something. Are you going to the club room? If you are, can you tell Miss Kam Yamashiro that I'll be late? I'll head over after I stop by the library. You'd better do as I ask. She's probably seeing Sagamiya <laughs> at the library. Maybe. Ooh. If you forget, you're dead meat. Okay. Dang. Why does she say such dreadful things in such a lighthearted tone? Poor guy. And it Big just F. wants me to progress time, alright. And then we go back to school. Students are milling around me high, to high for club activities in the afternoon, even during summer break. I walk around the campus in a day since I don't have any friends. Nobody talks to me and I don't talk to anybody. Damn. Depressed. Mimi is in the club room. Oh, it's just you. You surprised me. I'm just getting to work on my summer assignments. I bet I'll be more productive here than I would be at home. So I asked Miss Yamashiro if she'd open up the club room for me, since she's at school today. Scott, you should get your assignment done too, instead of wandering around town. Summer homework? I wonder if there's anything in the world more pointless. <laughs> Damn. And now we're going to the mansion. When I get back to the mansion, the lights are on. Someone must be home. The living room. There's an event. Tadaima! Oh. Is it? I tell her that Yukino's in the room. Mimi nods. Ne, Tazanami Dori no Ega Kang! Atarashi no Hajimata no Steta? No, I didn't. Dayo ne! Soko. Demo Nichiobi da Tara Ikeru no. Demo Asaichi wa Tsura Ikoro. Yapari Gogo no Kai da ne. Uh, she probably intends to go with Sagamiya. F. My man feel, my man feel it down on death. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. He sounds depressed as hell. <laughs> Yikes. She's gonna see the movie with the cool guy. It is not me. Pepe has. Come on, man. Be a chat already and stand up. We know he turns into a chat at the end of every round. I wonder how it's going to awaken in this one. Oh, morning. You're up already. We already... what? We're already in the second half of summer break. Make sure you spend your time with some sort of purpose, okay? Huh? Me? I've been so busy, I'm exhausted. I still have some tennis matches left, too. You shouldn't m m mope around. Uh, what does that say? Flavor your life with the things you like. I don't like a lot of things. <gasps> Flavor my life with the things I like. Okay. I saw like it was an inspirational quote or something, bro. <clears throat> um, next we're going to the station. That one. As the trains arrive, blah blah blah. I'm pretty sure I've had that I should know. Alright. Sazanami Street is crowded with people doing their shopping. 
Mimey is standing in front of the movie theater, staring at the poster that's been hung up there. I wonder if she's interested in it in, in the new movie. She told us about it the other day, bro. Maybe I should go talk to her. Yeah, friend. she really did. What a clown. Mimey turns away from the poster and walks away. Okay. And now we're going to the mansion. The lights are on in the mansion. Someone must be home. Okay. Yukino is writing furiously at the table. As I watch her curiously, Yukino notices me looking at her and glances up. Oh, do you know about these puzzles? Your color and squares according to logic. When you're done, you have a picture. Ah, Picross. I played that shit literally every day. <clears throat> but my research Yeah, was... I remember you talking about that. Bruh, I love Picross. I play Picross every day. If I showed you how many fucking Picross things I have done on my phone, you'd be disgusted by how much time I've spent on Picross. <laughs> they recently released a Hatsune Miku Picross, and it's like... Oh, jeez. I think it's like $20, $30, and I've, I've held back all my power from buying it. Because I think $30 for a puzzle game like that is way too expensive. But man, it hmm. looks good. <laughs> I was so mad when I found out Japan released um, Mario Picross on the Nintendo Switch Online, but America didn't get it. And I was like, bro, give me Mario Picross for free. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've been told I'm so weird for thinking Picross is fun. It's just math, but it's like cool. It's fun. It's simple. I don't know. It's I fun. Mean at the end of the day, it's personal preference. Yeah, I, I sit in bed. It really before is. Before I go to bed, I lie in bed and fucking just do some Picross. <laughs> I love Picross. It's so much fun. <clears throat> Alright, <clears throat> back to the game though. Um, when, I re when my research wasn't going so well, I started craving some puzzles I could solve. Uh, so I got this at the bookstore. This kind of puzzle was invented in the late 1980s. But this crazy thing is, two people published them independently in two different magazines at the same time. Both were Japanese. One was a man and the other a woman. Do you believe this story? Truth is, some sometimes stranger than fiction. But never mind, that wasn't the point. Uh, I wish I could solve all my problems as easily as these puzzles. Same, bitch. Same. Oh, I made a mistake somewhere. Puzzles can go from fun to stressful in an instant, don't you think? Yes. Yes, I do, baby. <laughs> uh, On a spiritual level, I feel I you. feel it in my soul. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you don't have to do them then. Damn, man. Come uh. on. Just vibe with no. the rock. Oh, an event. That itch, though. Yeah, I was just out and uh, about, you know. Did you know there was a new movie out? Uh, no, I didn't. Wait, they're not showing Forget Me Not anymore? What's on now? It's called Killer's Heaven. You know, it's starring that good-looking guy who's in World End with Nikare. Hmm. Oh, um, what's his name? It's completely slipped my mind. Maybe you're getting old, you know. Damn. Ooh. Huh? So you know his name then, Miami? The thing is, I can't remember either. Hmm, K something? Kogumo? Oh no, I totally can't remember. But anyway, that's the new movie they're showing now. Hmm, I wonder if I should go see it. Man, she's just trying to throw hints around. I think we can go on Sunday afternoon. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Oh, hey! I answer yes without a second thought. Huh? I actually need anything from you. Oh, Ed. It's like, when I see you, I feel like I need to talk to you. I wonder why. Okay. Damn. Swerve us and then give Oof. us a bit of hope? I don't understand, bro. <laughs> Mimi goes upstairs, mumbling to herself. I bet Mimi's going to see the movie with Saga Mia. Adolescence, how nice. Adolescence? Uh, you're the same age as... Oh, wait, never mind. Yeah, you I'm late. <laughs> I'm late. <laughs> I thought that was us. <laughs> well, she's not. She doesn't seem that much older than us, to be fair. She's, so, I, I can't she's in her, like, what, lower 20s? Yeah, yeah, she looks ma maximum three years older, I feel. You know, uh, it, it has no part in my life. In other words, this is none of my business. Damn. Come on, MC. What Kermit doing, sipping man? on the tea. <sighs> I see a choice coming up in the, uh, in the shit over there, and I'm worried I'm going to fucking press X too soon. <laughs> 
Peaky. Be careful. Ah, okay, good. Uh, I walked past the theater without giving it much thought, much more thought. Mimi is there, staring at the poster. She's alone, not with Sagamiya. I am very curious why it considers me seeing this scene, but okay. Uh, curious, I sneak up behind her. Can you eat that all yourself? Whoa, you scared me! What are you doing here? Oh, she's saying it herself. Popcorn. See, I told you. Huh? Oh, I'm not here to watch a movie. She pushes me forward forcefully before I knew it. I'm in the oh. theater. Oh my. I mean, hey, free movie. Movie theater tickets can be expensive. Uh, you know what? True. How, how much are they usually for you guys? Movie tickets here can go up to like $15. Uh, honestly, can't remember. It's been a hot minute since yeah. I've been to one. You know, that's yeah. fair. Considering it's been maybe a year and a half since COVID. None of us have probably gone to see one, right? Funny enough, the year before COVID, I saw like the most movies and theaters I have ever had, which was two. Two that year. Um... <laughs> Around 13. Really? Damn. Yeah, it's 13, 14 bucks. Very similar. Hmm. Well, I guess they get you with the food prices, not the ticket price. Oh, dude, that's exactly what it is. Fucking popcorn for like $7. <laughs> Fuck that shit. For the entire two and a half hours of the movie, I'd been thinking about Mimi. And about Sagamiya. And about Mibu. <laughs> And now, Mimi is sitting next to me. Just what emotions are hidden behind that easygoing facade of hers? I thought her elbows touched. Bruh. <laughs> that, that sounds so bad. Like, oh god. <laughs> that's, wow. I mean, that's not, the first, that's, that's not the first time I've thought, I, I've seen in, like, things that elbows touching have been considered, like, Emotional. I guess it's because in Japan, physical contact isn't a common thing. Um, I, I'm just remembering that time when uh, it was really early in the friendship of me and uh, f a bunch of our other friends in, a, in the server uh, in New Greenland, you guys would know. Uh, when we had all first met, we were doing puzzles in Tabletop Sim, and Fatosh was making the girl's elbow in the puzzle, and he said it was the sexiest part of a woman's body. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. <clears throat> Let's continue. Uh, it, it was okay, but you must think I'm a loner, huh? I didn't think I would be seeing a movie today. An extra ticket? Mimi, do you really think I... Hi, kiri kiri aruku! Thinking emoji? Why did she have an extra ticket? Hmm? Hmm. <clears throat> the sun hasn't set yet, but we decided to have an early dinner. We sit at a table facing each other. We both order pasta. The cafe isn't crowded yet, so our food arrives quickly. We dig in while we discuss the movie. Oh, beautiful. The sun sets on the horizon. Do you come to this cafe often? They put their money in the backgrounds. Yeah, dude. I'm actually so impressed because, like, in in visual novels, I feel like the most you'll see that are that is animated in the background it tends to be either water, the sky, which is usually like really lazy because you just have to loop some fucking clouds, right? Um, and like. Sometimes, if they're in a building, the fucking, like, monitors or things that are on a computer. That's, like, usually maximum what's animated. But, like, this shit's got some really nice small things, which is, you know, nice. Even the characters themselves. Yeah. They'll blink without us doing anything. 
my saga mia <laughs> Mimi looks flustered an expression I've never seen on her face before that's the moment our dessert cake arrives <laughs> Bro, this chef's trying to cut my fucking question, bro. <laughs> right? You were fat once? <laughs> Jesus. Jesus Christ. Mimi <laughs> joyfully takes a big bite out of the chocolate pound cake. You do look <laughs> happy. I can't believe you, your character just brings that up, no hesitation. I mean, main character does. I don't think he's ever given a single shit. <laughs> I guess not. The main character is the most like brutal guy. It would. I mean, it explains why he didn't have friends until he moved here, right? Not straight up. It would. Yeah. Like at least the small town guys are gonna are gonna be like, oh, we'll give him a chance. He's new. He's related to someone, and he's living there. Like, and she's also kind of a snarky person, right? So like, he can kind of fit in with that attitude. But it's surprising he hasn't gotten his ass beat yet. <laughs> I mean, I guess he has by the ninja by Hattori. Oh yeah. My Mia abruptly steers the conversation back to that topic. She says, <laughs> I see. I wonder it is he likes about you so much about you. Huh? Your rudeness? あのさ、私いいところって言ったんだけど、しかも即答するんじゃねえよ。マジか。数ヶ月とはいえ、一緒に暮らしてる奴にいいところを思いつかないと言われる私。ショックだな、女としてショック。Who <笑> cares what I think? You're popular, Sagamiya. Kensuke, I heard you had a fan club when you were first here. Kensuke, you give me the deets. <laughs> oh, poor Mimi. It's true. That, saying that's kind of mean, I, I, I have to, uh, have to admit. <laughs> yeah, it is. I'm not disagreeing, <clears throat> but it is mean. <laughs> All right. Well, Sato, which... Which which answer do you think it is? I'm going to pick the right one anyway, but I'll let you uh, think about which one is the right one. Hmm. <laughs> I don't mind either way. Is that is that your final answer? Yeah, mostly because the middle one sounds like uh the middle one sounds like uh Sounds like, uh, if, if she's just quiet, then, uh, it makes things awkward. All right, well. That's exactly what it's saying. Yeah, it is exactly what it's saying. Uh, but I will say, Sato, you're wrong. The answer is you're cuter that way. Also, once again, proving MC kind of a dick. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. Right? The game's I'm like I, I was thinking I was looking at the guy and I was like is I is this are you sure about this? But nope, that's the right one apparently. Right? Okay. I chose my words carefully to tell her that I like me my mew when she's talkative. We get kicked out of the theater. Jesus, okay. Uh, we don't have a TV. And why are you acting all cutesy all of a sudden? <laughs> what? Is she drunk? What happened? Hmm? This is... I take a bite of Mimi's chocolate cake. 
This has oh, brandy no. in it. Oh no. <laughs> so, I knew something was up. I, I totally <laughs> forgot I totally forgot about that uh well, that part of her description. Yeah, the chocolate bonbon incident from the beginning of the game. Yeah. Oh god, I forgot. Pardon me? Uh check please. Did they really just give cake with alcohol to a minor? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Yo. That's not something that would fly here. Um, right? I sit Mimi down on the beach to get some fresh air from the sea breeze. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Will I? Oh. When I'm an when I'm an adult, Mimi, who gets drunk drunk off a single drop of alcohol in a whiskey bonbon, resolves to overcome her acute alcohol tolerance by the time she turns twenty. Mimi can be rowdy, but is actually very critical of herself. After two years of intense training, she finally improves her alcohol tolerance. But when she attends a company new hire welcoming party, oh no. Uh oh. I'm sure you can, but if you get this drunk, you're gonna paint a big target on your back. Huh? Not guitar. I said target. A target on your back. Oh, forget it. Wow. <laughs> Are you worried about someone seeing us like this and getting the wrong idea? Like Sagamiya, for example. <laughs> you don't? Huh? Oh! Huh. Why? You don't mean anyone like that every day. Seems like a waste. I wonder why I find myself <laughs> rooting for Sagamiya. The ticket, so she got it from Sagamiya. Mimi looks up at me with watery eyes. How would I know? Mimi closes her eyes. Those soft lifts move slightly. Okay. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> I lean closer, finding myself gravitating towards those lips. These always get off. Uh, um, <clears throat> these get super off. Yeah. You guys are cousins. <laughs> it's us three boys here just just watching a dude almost kiss a drunk girl. Uh, luckily, what the? What kind of high school student passes out drunk? <laughs> We're safe. We're safe, boys. No, hey. no need to call the police today. I call for a taxi and carry Miami home. Well, that was almost a uh, police report. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Our main character almost went a bit far there. Ooh, boy. Let's see how much mm -mm. I can see today. Morning. Remember, kids, consent. And with someone who's not in your family. Yes, consent is cool, friends. Consent is cool. If you want to do it with your family, as long as it's legal in your state. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> <laughs> How many states in America have it legal? I know there's a lot, actually. More than you'd I expect. Don't know. 
I mean, the fact that Alabama exists. <laughs> <laughs> Only three. I don't know what you're talking about. A lot. No, there's more than three. Bro, I just looked it up. <laughs> oh my god, you actually looked it up? Yes, so now I, I don't have to need look you. It up. Like, listen, America has a lot of things going on. I don't need you to false spread even more things. Let me let me check. I have to check. Alabama is definitely one of them, right? No. What? Rhode Island, Ohio, and New Jersey. Wait, sorry, name them again. Rhode Island, Ohio, and New Jersey. Hmm. Rhode Island, Ohio, and New Jersey. Apparently, those are some like dangerous areas because they're pretty close to the north, <laughs> and we know people from those yeah. areas. <laughs> we do. <laughs> oh my god! Now I have to check. I, I'm checking now because I I need to know what's 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 up with this. What's going on? Apparently, it's only legalized in Ohio, but there are some exceptions with Rhode Island and New Jersey. I think. Honestly, I'm not looking too into this, but um, stuff and things. The fact right, okay, some... in Ohio, it's in Ohio, it's fully legal. In the states of New Jersey and Rhode Island, it's sort of legal, apparently. Sort of legal. Sort you of. You can legal. have intercourse with a relative, but neither state permits marriage. Ohio, you can have marriage. Wow. So long as they are not your parents. Oh. Alrighty then. According to this thing I'm looking at right now, uh, United, the United States is ranked third of 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 the like countries <clears throat> in the world where incest is legal. What the hell? There's only one state with it completely legal. Also, though, pretty crazily, it's still way smaller. Uh, than the top two countries, which are a million more, literally no, a billion more, one billion more, in each of them. That's insane. Oh my god, <laughs> holy shit. Okay, let's let's get the fuck off this topic. Back to the story. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I am. Are you talking to me? <laughs> No, I didn't. It wasn't even fun for me either, you know. I called you a taxi, took you home and everything. Uh oh. You ordered dessert yourself. What? <laughs> This chick's tripping. Actually, usually when she gets wound up, she always freaking, uh, blames some stuff on us. Yeah. Bruh. Oh my god, did that really- I'm gonna, I might have to censor that. I'm gonna, oh my god. <laughs> That's not what I was coming on there. I totally forgot that was there. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh my god, it's there Trigger again. Warning. Stop using the word. <laughs> Indeed. Hanako Yamada's verbal tick when she feels pressured, she's not very aware of it. And that's just how the mystery club operates. Everyone starts arguing. In the midst of all that, Mimi seems to be your usual self, too. Come to think of it, Miss Yamashiro asked me to stay behind after school. I could do Oh no. Her. What should I do? <sighs> what day is it? The 19th? And wants to be going to school, the club room, okay? Seen all this. Sorry, Miss Yamashiro asked for me for my help. Mimi and I are helping take the new social st studies worksheets to the social studies room. This morning, Miss Yamashiro had asked me for a favor that required some physical strength. By the way, the other person who asked for help, Kensuke, escaped as soon as he left the club room. 
So Mimey, who happened to be in the room at the time, got mm. caught up in it instead. I'm glad it was Mimey, since she has superhuman strength. <laughs> I didn't say that mm. out loud, did I? The two of us head to the teacher's office to get the worksheets. Oh my god. Well, Miss Yamashiro is talking to somebody at the end of the hall. It's Mibu Kamashiro. Miss Yamashiro gives him a smile and a wave, then leaves him. あら。二人とも<笑> Miss Yamashiro, uh, you just admitted that Mibu is a player. So come, eh? Gome, what does Korea Karakaigi da Kara? She's gonna drop that and leave? <laughs> yeah, right. She's gonna drop that and leave? Yeah, right. She's gonna drop that and leave? Yeah, right. I hope we're dealing with all, only with some books here. Yeah. That was more work than I expected. Oh, okay. I like to be alone with a hot, nice, stylish girl who likes to take care of things and. <laughs> These two fucking dickheads. <laughs> Where did that confidence come from? Who's the one who let their good catch go? <laughs> you dumped him, right, Sagami? I mean. You did, Mimi. You said so when you were drunk. あ、ちゃ。それさ、人に言わないでくれる。私が断ったとか噂でも広まったら詐欺ミアファンにぶっ殺されるの私だからさ。そもそも私と付き合うなんて無理だよ。Watch Kinsuke is like standing right next to the door listening. Yo, Kensuke with a gun. Ready to shoot Sagamiya. And you can't cook. So, so, Ursena, you're a good honky in Ariba. Take it a car. Have you ever tried? No, ever. Kitchina Hiranaina, you can't go to a e car. I remember that. What a Wenotanani, let it pass it to me. Oh, my, yo, wait, hold on. Ah, uh oh. Huh? The floor is softer than I remember. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Uh. <laughs> I already know. Yeah, right? <laughs> oh shit! So uh. Sorry! Ow! Uh, my cheek throbs, but on one plus side, my hand remembers. Oh, stop. I'm not reading that. I'm not reading <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I was about to uh -oh. read that. <laughs> okay, all right. So, wow, that was something, wasn't it, boys? <laughs> um, hmm. It really was. Jesus Christ. While I wait for Mimi to come back to the living room, I think about how I can apologize to her properly. Mimi-chan, <laughs> you're I'm tired, so I'm going to sleep early. Oh, God. Good night. Good night. Oh, poor main character. That, it's not his fault, but that, that, that CG was a little graphic. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, I guess it, really it I don't know. Was it as bad as the time Saya was on top of us? That one was pretty bad, too. <laughs> um, I think that one was worse. Yeah. That, this one, rather. Really? Mm, I guess. Uh, uh, or, or Rainy Kaido. Uh, oh, yeah, the Rainy out. Kaido race, dead one. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> This game's a little risque, isn't it? <laughs> um, <laughs> it's almost 11 p.m. Mimi still isn't home. She's late. Maybe I should text her. 
No, that would be too obvious. Besides, I should apologize to her in person. That's why I'm waiting for her like this. I recall Mimi's expression back in the club room. That embarrassed look that I'd never seen before. While I'm thinking about this, I hear the front door unlock. Oh, Tadaima. Uh, welcome home. Uh, this isn't like Mimi. I guess she's really upset about before. <sighs> Mimi sighs heavily and flops into the sofa. I'll apologize now, like a man. Uh, Mimi, uh, about this afternoon, I... She looks at me. I'm really sorry. I didn't do it on purpose, but I, I think... I mean, you're a girl, Mimi, so... <laughs> yeah, he sucks yeah. at this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Huh? No, that's not what I'm apologizing for. あ、私が部屋でジミチにハグ組んでいたジグソーパズルを勝手に完成させてしまった。ノー。嘘でしょ。あ、オッケー。あ、オッケー。あ、オッケー。あ、オッケー。あ、オッケー。あ、オッケー
私このお手紙ずっと前に読んでたんだただのラジオ DJ の私が病気のココナちゃんのためにできることなんかないってだけどココナちゃんに教わったの私のお仕事はみんなに少しでもこうんうん人生だなんてそんな長くなくていい明日を今を生きる力をあげることなんだって何ができるかまだわからないけどココナちゃんの手術に間に合ったらいいなココナちゃん頑張らなくていいお医者さんが頑張ってくれる本当だよだけど怖いよねわかるよココナちゃんはその怖さに勝とうだから頑張れココナあとは少しだけほんの少しだけ読み人よ今宵だけは私のココナに力を。Okay, that was a, that's a way to do、weird. things. Yeah, that was fucking weird.、Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but I was gonna, I was, I was gonna want to end the episode, but then that happened, so I, I was like, oh, gotta keep going. <laughs>、um, It's a little bit longer. Yeah, and that, this way now, next episode,、uh, we'll have the hospital scene immediately. So、uh, I think this is a good place to stop. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, that last part of this was weird.、Uh, went on a date with Miami. That was fun until the little last bit. Something's clearly going on because she's not doing anything with Sagamia, but she's being a little sus still. I don't. I'm really curious as to where that'll go. Well, we'll find out. I have、now. my own thoughts about it. Ooh,、but. all right. Let's hear them. What, what are your thoughts, bro? I think it might have something to do with Mibu. Oh, yeah? That's a. That's a because. They did, because they, of did their trip.、Mm-hmm. Like、sense. the trip to the Kanashiro、uh, Manor, and then her comment about、uh, Yamashiro, or from Yamashiro,、mm-hmm. where she said, don't judge a book by its cover, and, and Miami said,、uh, I hope we're just talking about the book. Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Interesting, interesting. Well. We will hopefully find out in the next time we play、uh, in World End Syndrome. Thank you guys for watching. Scott Bloom F. May B. Cheever. Sato. Out. See you guys next time.